Welcome back. November is Alzheimer's Awareness Month. Most people think that disease only affects the elderly. It's so true, but Kimberly Van Scoy shows us it can also impact someone in their 30s and 40s. Trevor Lundy and his wife thought they would be spending this part of their life traveling the world. Instead, at just 55 years old, Darlene is in the late stages of Alzheimer's. So her personality started changing. She was only 46 when she started showing symptoms. She started getting more uh, aggressive and wanting to stay just us, nobody else, not a single person, anybody that would come in, she'd be very frustrated and um, irritated. It took years for the Lundys to get a firm diagnosis, even though Darlene was having delusions, could no longer complete simple tasks, and had no short-term memory. You know, she would get lost in the grocery store, um, would get lost in, 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 on the road. Nine years later, there are excruciating times when Darlene no longer recognizes Trevor, but then there will be a moment of clarity. When I get that smile from her, or when she tells me she loves me, um, it's, it's awesome. She now requires round-the-clock care, which has strained the family's finances. But Trevor says each day he still has with her is a blessing. The way I cope is being and spending as much time as I can with her, um, because she was my best friend, you know, and it is, still is. Friends have set up a GoFundMe page to help Trevor and Darlene pay medical expenses, which exceed several thousand dollars each month. So far, they've raised over $4,000. If you would like to help, there's a link to the GoFundMe page in the Scene on 12 section of WXII12.com. I'm Kimberly Van Scoy, WXII 12 News.